Yeah, yeah man, shots out to V1 Visions. Hey, look, V1 Visions. If you ain't watching that, then you ain't watching shit, nigga. Yo, yo, yo. Yes, 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 yes. yes. It's good. So who I'm here with today, man? Boomy Boomy, man. I'm going AKA to go, the, man. The, the Big Belly Rude Boy, AKA you don't know what the fuck I go on, AKA I got the packs for the motherfucking low, man. <laughs> I'll let your boy, man. For sure, for sure, man. You know, before, earlier, man, everybody that we done, well, mostly everybody that we interviewed, they talked about you, man. Mm -hmm. They let, they was letting know, like, you know, you was a mentor, like, you top dog. Top dog, you know, right, right, right. Like, sports. like you, you like that, you feel me? Yeah, bro. They said you was, like, top five or some shit. Yeah, like, shit, I just take, take what I do serious, man. That's all the fuck I do. Well, hey, since a youngin', since a youngin', music, bro. I ain't fuck with no video games. I ain't had no, you know what I mean? It was like, man, put me on some music shit. Let's rock out, bro. That's sure, all. Sure. Right there. So, um, how was your childhood, man? Childhood, childhood was, how can I say, it was interesting. You know what I mean? We, we came from a, my mom was born in, over here in North Carolina, but she left when she was 18. So she went to Jamaica, you know what I mean? Grew up there 18 years, flew us back over here. And um, we've been rocking out there since. Came back to a town called Edenton, and and shit was a little different, man, because we we got looked at like like outsiders, bro. You know what I mean? What like, you mean about that? Like, like we was we was them Jamaicans. <laughs> you know what I mean? It was like who them Jamaicans with them stuff in their hair? You know what I mean? We was like one of the first niggas around Edenton with dreads, bro. So when that shit, when they see my mom with dreads, they was like, what the fuck is that in her hair? You know what I mean? Right. So it was a little, it was interesting, man. But we, we fought through that shit. Now everybody rocking dreads. Everybody want to be Jamaican. <laughs> everybody want to eat curry chicken. Everybody claim they a Don Don. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, in one of your songs, they said they knew me for, before the name switch. Yeah, Mark Dog. So, yeah, how'd yeah. that go? How'd that went about? Mark Dog, Mark Dog came about from, for real, for real, my homeboy Kappa. Capo, he, I went over his crib, me and Capo, twins, my nigga, since young as that, um, I went over to his crib one time, and that nigga, before he came, Capo, that nigga, his name was K-Dog, so when I see his damn name, like, K-Dog, like, shit, my name gonna be Mark Dog then, fuck that shit, you know what I mean, and plus I already like the pop shit, you know, it's just like, shit, Mark Dog, guns, bar shit, let's, let's go with Mark Dog, but my mom hated that shit, though. Oh my, I hated that man. Okay, and now it's Umi Boomin. What yeah, that come? How that come about? Umi Boomin came about because my mom hated Mark Dog. So I was like, when I went, and then when I went down to Florida, <clears throat> everybody and their mom had a. It was like Swamp Dog, White Dog, Gator Dog, this dog that like it was rappers out there like that. You know what I mean? Like Dog Dog. And then I think my sister took my shit up to Fat Joe one time and gave him my own CD. And when he seen the shit said Mark Dog, he was like, damn, another dog? Like, we ain't trying to hear. You know what I mean? So when that happened, I was like, damn, bro, your name could really, like, turn a motherfucker from me. I was like, shit. I was like, shit, my name, Umi anyway, that's my real name. It's like, Umi, I'm going to throw Umi up there and it's different. And then I came up with a song called I'm Booming. And then I just put Umi Boomin on that shit. And then it was going since. It's a catch to it, too. Yeah, man. Shouts out to V1 Visions. Hey, look, V1 Visions. If you ain't watching that, then you ain't watching shit, nigga.